Thanks for stopping in, everybody. It's another video where I predict a NFL game, and we've got a Sunday morning game that's in London. The Jacksonville Jaguars versus the Buffalo Bills. This is Bean Beansworthy Entertainment. Thank you for guys. Thank you guys for stopping by, and I hope that you guys enjoyed the video. If you enjoyed the content, hit that subscribe button, and also like the video. I'm just going to give my honest opinion, and I'm just some guy behind a chair and posting videos to YouTube. So do with that what you will. I enjoy the support, and thank you to everybody that has already subscribed and everybody that watches the video. I love you. Thank you, guys. Be kind and respectful to each other, and most of all, be kind and respectful to yourself. Most of all, you're the number one person in this world. Nobody's more important than you. And please don't give up. Talk to some if you're having bad thoughts, talk to somebody, find a friend, go for a walk or something if you're not really a people person, but just do something. People love you, people care about you. You do matter. Let's move on and let's get into the video. Again, thank you guys. Love you. Everything else is all good. Yeah, we're not going live with anything. I'm going to cut and edit this. We're almost at 1 o'clock in the morning. Those guys over in England are about to be getting up here soon. The Jags-Bills game is going to be at 8.30, just a few hours away. Going to get this clipped up, made up, and posted before a couple hours beforehand, so it's going to be there in the morning. The Bills have only a few people out christian benford is questionable greg rousseau and tredavious white is out they still have von miller even though that he's on the ir they have him on the report and that's the bills for their injury report for tomorrow morning that is jamal agnew questionable zay jones questionable parker washington and devin lloyd are out for the game that's unfortunate. That's on the Jaguar side. All right. Time to start the prediction for the Sunday morning football game. We're going to have a separate video for the noon games. And then I'm going to make a video for the afternoon. And then we'll go to the Sunday night. And then we'll have the Monday night. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. Again, if you guys enjoy the video, hit that like button on the video. Subscribe to the channel. Hopefully you guys enjoy it. We have the Jags and Bills over in London just in a few hours. I'm recording this at 1 o'clock in the morning, my time. Jags are 2-2, two two, Bills are 3-1 and one, coming off of that spectacular win over the Miami Dolphins where Josh Allen proved that last week at least the offense was more explosive than the Bills. Or, or the Dolphins. The Bills offense was more explosive than the Dolphins. My bad. Sorry about that. But over here in London, Jacksonville Jaguars finally saw an offense that we kind of like to see. But unfortunately, we got them going against the Bills. And I know this, it, it, really this comes down to what kind of Josh Allen shows up. But with the way that the Jags defense is, uh, they're not playing terrible, but they're t playing Mid-level, and I feel like Josh Allen is going to be able to exploit it. So I got the B Buffalo Bills. I've got the Buffalo Bills offense scoring five touchdowns it, all together. And just for a year, it, on the year, they've only they've gotten 14 in four games. So just in one game, I'm predicting that they're going to get five touchdowns. A couple field goals, I got them beating... 47 to 27. I've got the Jaguars being able to get a couple of touchdowns through the air, but that the rushing defense of the Bills is ranked 20th in the league, 474 rushing yards through four games, and the Jacksonville Jaguars only have 400 rushing yards even at 19th in the league. So literally those two that those two numbers matching up when it come comes down to it. Because I've got it scaled, the the higher the ranking means the better the defense. Obvious, I I hope that makes sense. But I mean, Bills are 
uh, rocking the better turnover differential at plus six. The Jags do have a plus four. Both teams have a pick six this year. Um, offense on the Bills is four picks and one fumble. And on defense, they've got eight picks and three fumbles. That's That defense has been doing good. So Josh Allen is, or Trevor Lawrence is going to have to deal with that. Josh Allen, I was already moving forward to Josh Allen talking about the fact that the Jags have only gotten four interceptions this year. They've got five fumbles. That's majority of where their turnovers has come, have come from. And the Jags have two picks and two fumbles. So maybe maybe we can expect one of those touchdown one of those touchdown another touchdown out of the defense for the Bills. I'm not really sure on that one. Uh but let's be moving on. All right, moving it, moving further into it. The Bills, the Bills have only allowed 55 points on this year. That's number two in the league. Jaguars are pretty high up there in the rankings. They're 12th at 82 points, but unfortunately, Bills, Bills have better stats. Bills are a better team that that is built all around so yeah like bills 47 jaguars 27 the game's only a couple hours away starts at 8 30 i believe i know that it's the morning and that was the report for the sunday morning game hopefully predictions went right we will see after it and i'll let you guys know hope you guys have a good day and enjoy the game if you enjoy the content, hit that subscribe button and like the video. Thank you guys, and I'll see you next time.